Hi, my name is Natalie Horvath, and I'm an IGP student graduating this fall of 2024 with a double major uh, in sustainability and Spanish. And I just want to talk a little bit about my year abroad in Ecuador. So I attended La Universidad San Francisco de Quito, uh, in Quito, the capital of Ecuador. And it's a very beautiful private university, um, founded only like 35 years ago. And they have really cool features, um, buildings and ponds. Um, right here we have Gaston to my left, um, the university pig. <laughs> Um, and you can take them out and walk in. Um, they have a great abroad program, and I met a lot of abroad students and Ecuadorian students. Um, in the middle is Karina and Andy, uh, also students who attended uh, USFQ and from IGP. And in the bottom, I have my dogs that I had in my host family. And it was amazing. I loved them so much. They're like one of the best parts of my experience um, in the fall. Uh, for my university, um, they didn't have a good choice, I think, for hands-on research. So I chose this biological station um, called Un Poco del Choco. And it was a very remote biological station, 40 minutes from the nearest pueblito. And um, I used dry toilets, solar energy. Everything was just very ecologically friendly. And the goal of the station was to advocate and conserve the Andean Choco, which is one of the most important biodiversity hotspots in the world. And during my time here, I um, contributed to three conservation projects. Um, the first and foremost being avian research and monitoring, which was Nicole's PhD. And basically we would wake up, ban the birds and put up nets where we could capture them all morning and age them and basically just put a little band on them. The camera traps were just a method to observe ground life and any ground birds and mammals that pass through the station. And lastly, I helped a grad student with his herpetology field guide and taxonomic list, basically doing five hour transects uh, in the morning and night. And I had a wonderful experience overall. It was very informative for me and very eye-opening to be able to experience so many cultures and um, people from so many different backgrounds as the biological station hosted um, students from all over the world. So I definitely got my intercultural competence. <laughs> um, but yes, thank you so much for listening, and I hope you attend my poster and see me at the summit. Thank you.